Happy Friday, everyone. <laughs> it's Friday. Yay. Anybody else excited for the weekend? Not that we can go anywhere or do anything, right? <laughs> We're going to be working in our yard again, but I'm so excited about it. So excited about working in, in our yard because it's going to be nice and sunny and warm and we've got some planting to do. Hey, Heather. Hey, Pam. All right, so I wanted to share something with you. Um, I love a bargain. I love simplicity. And as you all know, I love cleaning. <laughs> so I want to show you a little, oh, it's raining, Heather. Mm. It's sunny here. I wish I could send the sun to you. <laughs> um, so I always like to share easy ways that, and inexpensive ways that you can clean areas of your house, rooms of your house, items in your house, um, on a budget, especially if you're on a budget. All right. So I want to share with you my scouring powder hack. Okay. Now this item, you can go to the dollar store if your dollar store is open right now and you can get one of these. You can get a Parmesan cheese shaker or if you want to make several of these scouring powder, um, this scouring powder recipe, you can do salt and pepper shakers or spice shakers. Um, or, you know, when you go to an Italian restaurant or a pizza place and they have those um, glass shakers with the red pepper flakes and all that, like if you can find those, that's really good too. A dollar, a dollar. For this okay and so you could you could buy several of them and you could put one underneath your kitchen sink you could put one underneath your bathroom sink you could put one wherever in all your bathrooms for a dollar okay so I want to share with you my scouring powder and I have a secret ingredient that you have to put in this scouring powder and it might surprise you that it's not an essential oil even though I do put essential oils always in everything that I ever make <laughs> hey Amy hey girl um hi Myra hi Liesl so anyway I want to share with you it's simple 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 ingredients that you can probably go to your pantry right now and you can whip it up and um, yes you can use this on your shower you can use this on your tub you can sprinkle it in your toilet bowl you can sprinkle it in all of your sinks but here's the trick this is what I do first is that I spray all of this stuff. I spray sinks, toilet bowls, showers, bathtubs, anything like that with my Thieves multi-purpose cleaner. So my spray bottle, I have two capfuls of Thieves household cleaner and about two to three cups of water. And then I always add essential oils just because I love the smell. I love the extra cleaning power. I love the degreasing powder, especially when you're using like lemon and um, those citrus oils are really great at helping to get the grease up. So always add my oils to my Thieves multi-purpose cleaner spray, spray bottle. So I spray all of this first, right? Spray them all first. Then I take my scouring powder that I keep in this shaker. Now, what is in here, you ask? There is a special ingredient in here. <laughs> Amy, clean your toilets. <laughs> all right so all it is is baking soda shocker right baking soda and or so you could do one cup two cups you know make up a big batch of this of baking soda if you want you can use just that and you can use about 10 20 drops of your favorite essential oil I have in here purification especially for toilets because they're stinky, right? So purification is a great oil blend that you can use to help dispel odors. Now, um, you can also make another one of these if you want to, if you have super washing soda. So you can do half a cup of baking soda, half a cup of super washing soda, and your drops of essential oil. Now, the secret ingredient that you need to add into your scouring powder is cream of tartar. 
You're going to put two teaspoons of cream of tartar in with your baking soda or your baking soda and super washing soda, okay? So that is, it's a great um, brightening, whitening ingredient. It's also really great at just helping to polish and buff and clean. And it's just, it's a really great, I'm not going to get into the science as for a whole other <laughs> whole other time, but it works amazing on stainless steel, but you can also use it um, on your, you know, you can use it in your toilet bowl or whatever. Okay. Cream of tartar. I could probably do a whole live, which I might do, <laughs> of everything you can do with cream of tartar. Oh my gosh. But anyway, you want to add that to your scouring powder. Okay. So now if you are keeping this underneath your sink, your kitchen sink, or in your bathroom or whatever, there's a lot of moisture, right? So what I do is I always save these little packets that, that you always get in, I don't know, in, in your supplements. I get these from my supplements. Um, so I always save them. And my husband's probably looking at my stack <laughs> of these in our pantry. And it's like, why is she saving these? Okay, save these because you, I keep these in things like this. In fact, I don't know if you can see it, but I have one in here already. So I just stick one of those in here in my scouring powder. That way it absorbs the moisture and your powder will stay dry. So it's not going to get all... Um, clumpy or um, it's going to get all, you know, like one big hard block of baking soda. <laughs> you do not want that. Okay. So I just keep that in there. Um, so anyway, that's the trick, right? Take your Thieves Household Cleaner, multi-purpose spray, spray down your, um, your sinks, your toilets, your bathtubs, showers, then take your scouring powder of baking soda, cream of tartar, and, your, and essential oil, um, or your baking soda, super washing soda, cream of tartar, and oil, whichever you can, you know, if you've got super washing soda, awesome. Put that in here too. Do half and half. And then you just sprinkle it all over. And if you want to let it sit for a little bit, that's fine. Or if you want to scrub it and then let it sit before you rinse or flush the toilet, that's fine too. However you want to do it. But um, but anyway, it works really, really great. So yeah, that's my tip. Um, but I love being able to, I love going to the dollar store and finding little things that, um, I can use to like store stuff. Like, you know, you know, if you were to go to, um, like Target or even Walmart or any of those places and you were to, to get one of those, um, olive oil, you know, those olive oil, glass, whatever, crafts. I don't know what they're called. But anyway, with a little spigot. <laughs> I'm so technical, I know. But anyway, you can find those at the dollar store. You're going to spend probably five bucks at Target or Walmart for one of those or anywhere else. Um, but if you just go to the dollar store, you can also put your dish soap or your hand soap in one of those and have them on your kitchen sink and it looks pretty and it looks cute. Um, so there's, you never know what you can find at the dollar store. I love finding stuff like this because I want something cheap and I want something easy and this makes my life easier. This makes cleaning easier and that's what it's, oil drizzler. Thank you, Amy. <laughs> Yeah. So, um, but I just like, I, I just like to be able to reach underneath my kitchen sink, like, cause I do not like a dirty sink. Oh my gosh. I've said this before on other lives, but I do not like to have things in my sink. Like, especially before I go to bed, like my sink has to be clean. So anyway, what I do is I make sure, you know, all the dishes are taken care of or whatever. And then I spray thieves. Then I just reach underneath my sink, sprinkle, sprinkle. And then I take my little sponge and and then rinse and then ah. so anyway that's what I do that's my that's my trick but yeah but you can um, you can keep one of these I mean for a dollar come on and baking soda super washing soda those are both really inexpensive um, ingredients and then cream of tartar and then whatever oil you can switch it up you can put in pine lemon thieves uh, citrus fresh um, you can use rosemary, you can use any, whatever combination, put that in here and, um, yep. Sprinkle, sprinkle, scrub, scrub, rinse. <laughs> so 
clean. But anyway, I'm all about being frugal. I'm all about ease. I'm all about clean. Maybe that should be my new motto. <laughs> ease, clean. <laughs> anyway, easy breezy. Um, and I, <laughs> I hope that you guys have a great weekend. I hope this is helpful. Please share. Please share. If this was helpful and you learn something or if you know somebody who is a clean freak or who might need to know that you know hey we all need things that will help make our lives a little bit easier especially when it comes to when it comes to cleaning i like to clean i know not everybody likes to clean but i like to clean and that's why i'm always sharing with you my tips my recipes and my hacks and by the way i will post the recipe in the comments I might even post it. No, I'm not going to post it in the thing up there, but I will post it in the comments. That way you have it. Okay. Thank you so much. Share with your friends, tag somebody, um, spread the love. Have a great weekend.